happening. Oh, yeah. We had a crazy <laughs> spring else, uh, winter yeah. and that is now behind us. Spring is ahead of us and uh, some slight rain chances in our future. Yeah, especially slight rain chances for us here in Kern County, but the Sierras to our north looks like they could be getting a little bit of snow with this next system that we've been tracking. It's slowly inching toward the county, but it is associated with them with some isolated thunderstorms and we are seeing that right now in Fresno as well as down near Visalia and we do have the chance to see those slowly push toward Kern County. The best chance or place to see those thunderstorms would actually be just in the tippy northern part of of the county, so up near Delano, the potential to see that would be later this evening into the very early morning hours tomorrow. But let's look at this temperature 76 degrees right now here in Bakersfield. So that is down five degrees from what we were feeling this time yesterday. And this storm did squeeze out just a little bit of moisture early this morning, but mostly we've been seeing dry conditions with some storm clouds slowly moving into the county as we head into the evening hours tonight. That is going to be our best chance to see some rain beginning at around 9 p.m. continuing until right around three in the morning tomorrow. So as you can see, by the time midnight rolls around, we're going to be seeing some pockets of rainfall down near Taft as well as in Fraser Park, a little bit into Bakersfield. But by the time those early morning hours roll around, three in the morning. That is going to be our best chance to see some spotty showers and then conditions are going to be clearing out and winds are definitely going to be calming down as we head into your Wednesday. But just how much rain are we going to be seeing? Not too impressive of a storm, so maybe a few hundredths of an inch here in the valley, but areas like Arvin and Shirley Meadows could be seen potentially up to a tenth of an inch of rain. But as that system clears, another is on its heels late Thursday into the early morning hours on Friday and then yet another system late Friday into the early morning hours on Saturday and then as we head into the weekend keep all of those outdoor plans that you have because we are going to be drying out just a few clouds in the sky and temperatures will be warming up but needless to say our best chance to see that rain is going to be throughout the day on Friday temperatures dipping down into the upper 60s by Thursday but then slowly warming up as that final system makes its way through the county so 78 degrees by Sunday potentially reaching 80 degrees by Monday so similar story to what we were seeing this week the Kern River Valley will have a high of 67 degrees tomorrow with those showers on Friday. They'll be up to 66 to Hatchapi and Fraser Park going to be seeing their coolest day of the week on Thursday in those mid to low 50s. So not too bad again. Some spotty showers here and there, especially overnight tonight, but it looks like that best chance will be late Friday into Saturday, but clearing by 9 a.m. So if you're heading out to the superhero run, yeah. easy going. Yeah, good temperatures okay. too. All right, Allison, thanks. Well, there.